In Roman times, Emperor Nero ordered slaves to collect ice from mountaintops. They travelled miles in high-speed chariots simply to cool his favourite drink. I don't know. I'll have two more. Before fridges were invented, ice was expensive stuff that only the very rich could afford. In Britain, it was cut from frozen lakes in winter and kept cool in underground ice houses until summer. Ice was so rare, it was even imported in huge lumps from overseas. The first Brit to investigate refrigeration was a man called Francis Bacon. In 1626, he stuffed a chicken with snow to see if the meat would stay fresher longer. But unfortunately, he caught pneumonia and died before finding the answer. In 1916, American businessman Clarence Birdseye pinched the idea of freezing food from the Inuits. He saw that fish buried in ice were thawed out months later and still good enough to eat. Mr. Birdseye had an idea. He started his own frozen food company and the rest is history. The development of the fridge freezer finally meant that ice became available to everyone.